Okay, so there's a story in the news about this hobbit creature, this Homo floresiensis, that they say is now, um, they say it's 54,000 years old. And they used a to recent say, discovery? Uh, well, the recent discovery is that some scientists is examining the bones and they're determining that it is not human, like not Homo sapien. It's not even Homo erectus, a species right before human. And they're saying it kind of diverged from Homo habilis and it could date back as far back as two million years ago when it split with the uh, regular human lineage. So what is this, who is this related to? Is this related to humans? Yeah, it's related to humans, but it's separated uh, genetically by two million years, and whereas everything with humans kind of went in one direction, it might have branched off at some point, but it was pretty consistent. Even Neanderthals are considered Homo, I think it's Homo sapien Neanderthalus. This was a lost species that didn't evolve? It did evolve, but it evolved from Homo habilis, which is the next species after Australopithecus. So it's, it's interesting how a species like that can be separated by two million years, live on a special island where it's not conquered, doesn't become extinct, evolve on its own, not significantly probably. Not bothered by anyone. Yeah, and then then it go extinct on its own. Now, it might be related to some of these tales of people in Indonesia and other places around that area saying they have small people in the mountains. There's a lot of tales about that that still exist to this day. It might be relatives of this? Uh... Yeah, well, they just had that thing in the... You, you saw the video where there's uh, people that are uh, bikers that record themselves on their various bike journeys, motorcycle journeys, and they had that little human all of a sudden run, dart out and run in front of right, them. Right, but it's not very clear exactly what that is or who that is. I mean, we don't know if that's exactly what we're looking at here. Yeah, yeah, it could be a, a, a fake or something like that. But I mean, just the fact that there's a creature like this, they thought initially it was 12,000 years ago it went extinct. Now they're saying it's over 50,000 years ago. But in evolutionary terms, that's still relatively recent. So, I mean, it's just amazing that something like that... Prehistoric creature. Yeah, that, that, that they're still finding discoveries like that that are so recent um, in this modern age. It seems like everything's well, discovered. I think there's a lot of things yet to be discovered. 